I want to be here 10 years from now when we're going to the Super Bowl and winning a lot of games and one of the best teams in the league. Here he is against Bruce Smith. Maselli just stones him. He was fierce, angry, mean, and talk smack. Some guys are fierce competitors, and some guys are just absolutely relentless, and that was Tony. He wasn't going to let another man beat him. Every year he played healthy, he was, he was hands down the best tackle in the league. He was a ballerina playing offensive tackle, and he had that smirk, and you could see it. He just looked like he couldn't wait for the ball to be snapped so he could block the big name that was across from him, no matter who it was. If you line up across from him, I don't care who you are, you're going to get blocked. Ladies and gentlemen, now please welcome to the field Jacksonville Jaguars legend and Hall of Famer Tony Baselli. Welcome to the podium, Pro Football Hall of Fame President, Jim Porter. The mission of the Pro Football Hall of Fame is to honor the greatest of the game, preserve its history, promote its values, and celebrate excellence together. Today, we celebrate that excellence and honor Tony Bozzelli and his awesome family. Tony Bozzelli, the first ever Jacksonville Jaguar inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame. We honor Tony today by presenting him with his Hall of Fame Ring of Excellence created by Kay Jewelers. This Ring of Excellence, along with his bronze bust and his gold jacket created by Hager, are the three iconic symbols that represent induction into the Pro Football Hall of Fame. There have been over 300 million men and women who have played this game at any level. Only 5 million to play on college campuses and just 30,000 who have been part of the game at the professional level since the NFL was founded in Canton, Ohio in 1920. Tony Bozzelli is one of only 362 members of the Pro Football Hall of Fame. On behalf of the Hall's board, our staff, and your fellow Hall of Famers, Tony, it is our honor for Jaguars owner, Shad Khan, to present the Hall of Fame Ring of Excellence to Tony Bozzelli. And now, Jaguars owner, Shad Khan. Okay, Tony. You've earned the Hall of Fame ring. Maybe you want to open it up. Make sure it's there. <laughs> and you've earned the Hall of Fame jacket. And you've earned the love and respect of the entire community. Only one thing missing, the official retirement of number 71 by the Jacksonville Jaguars. <laughs> so Tony, it's my privilege to make it official, but I need a little help from Duval. <laughs> so count 
with me. Three, two, one. Ladies and gentlemen, Tony Baselli. Well, first of all, let me start by saying thank you, Sean. Thank you to the Khan family. I said this in Canton. You would never know that Sean Khan was not the owner of the Jaguars when I played here. Because the way he treats me, not only me, but all the alumni of this organization, He's like he's always been the owner, him and his family. So, Shaw, thank you so much. Thank you to Ann, and thank you for everything. I talked a lot about family when I was in Canton. And so I think I've talked enough about my wife and kids and all the people close to me. I love them. They know how much they mean to me. I wouldn't be here without them. I also am so thankful for my teammates. Who several of were at Canton, but are here this weekend on Alumni Weekend. Football is the ultimate team sport, and I wouldn't be sitting here without all the great players that put on the Jaguars uniform. And a special shout out to two of the best ever played, and hopefully one day we'll have a gold jacket, and that's Fred Taylor and Jimmy Smith. In my last couple minutes here. I think I've got about 60 seconds here before they rip me off this stage. More than anything, this moment's special to me because of you. I was looking forward to this. Canton was great. It all started back in February when one of my heroes, a guy I looked up to, Anthony Munoz, knocked at my door and told me I was in the Hall of Fame. But this moment is just as important to me because this is the moment I got to celebrate with you. You were here in 1995 when I walked on this field for the first time ever against the Green Bay Packers on a Sunday night game. And, you've been, and you're here today, but more importantly, you've been with me every step of the way. You were the greatest fans in the NFL. There's no other place I'd want to play than right here in Jacksonville with you fans. Thank you for the support. Thank you for the support, the love, the cheering. Every once in a while you booed. We probably deserved it. But more, more often than not, you guys have always been right there with us. Thank you so much. And I hope this is the start of a great 2022 for this team and this organization because you fans deserve nothing but the best. And before I go, we're going to do one last thing. I want the loudest Duval this group's ever done. Are we, can we do that? All right, here we go. One, two, three. Do more! Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, your Jacksonville Jaguars Hall of Famer, Tony Vaselli. Plus gives you access to